Hello, I'm your host Justin, and we are at King Jerry Lawless Memphis Barbecue Company out here in Cordova, Tennessee, on Germantown Parkway, right in front of the Super Target. Welcome to 901 Food Review Show for the 901. Yes, we are here with the King himself, Jerry the King Long. How are you doing, sir? Good. Justin, I'm doing great, and I'm really uh, excited to be here with you on this, uh, uh, hopefully, good exposure for my new uh, barbecue restaurant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let the people know, um, all the people that have been under a rock for uh, a little bit, um, who you are. They, well, you if do. they don't know who I am, they've had to been under a rock for a long, long time. <laughs> uh, especially here in Memphis, right? I've been coming into everybody's living rooms or, or dens on television every single week for the past 46 years. Wow! <laughs> Memphis wrestling started in 1971 or in 1970 and wrestled every Saturday morning on Memphis TV, channel 13, all the way to channel 5 for, for over 20 straight years. And uh, then of course, been with the WWE for the last 24 years, doing wow. Monday Night Raw, SmackDown, pay-per-views like WrestleMania, uh, and, all the, and still do that on a, you know, basically a monthly or weekly basis. So I, I kind of been out there in the wrestling business, not to mention all the live wrestling events that I've uh, performed at over the years. So, now I'm, I'm I'm taking a different a different path a different career path here. In okay. And we're going to see how this works out for me. Okay. Cool. Awesome. Where did the whole idea to combine wrestling with Memphis barbecue? Where did that whole idea come from? Uh, well, you know anybody that anybody that has grown up uh, and is from, from Memphis. Yeah. Got to be. Barbecue fan. Exactly. I mean, you know, we we eat it all our lives here, right. and I, that's been a you know it's been a main staple for me my entire life. And I I, I go in, and I have my favorites too. You know, I, I, over the years, but I've tried I've tried them all. Right. And I go in I go in a restaurant like Corky's, and there, you know, and there's there's my picture on the wall. Right. And I go in Central Barbecue. They got my picture hanging on the wall right, right here. One of my favorites of all time. And I'm, I'm going blank on the on the on the name right now. Um, Commissary, Rondi. Commissary's good. Rondi Moon's great. Picture on the wall there. Yeah. But no, the one where they had that little fire and they moved across the street and now they're back over there on uh, Parkway. Tom, how, Tom? how am I having? No, that's not. Uh, it. Um, how am I having this? I've been hit on the head a lot, folks. So no, that's, that's not a problem. Right. But anyway, uh, I, you know, I've gone to all of these places. I just my picture on the wall probably, because I've frequented so many of the barbecue right. restaurants in town. And then. Um, I just thought, hey, you know, I've done the wrestling. Why not try the barbecue? Uh, you know, I've, I've, I've built this this name recognition over the years, right. and I've eaten enough barbecue to know what's good and what's not good. Right. So uh, that's just what we wanted to try to do here is combine the two, you know. Right. And then, as you can see, uh, now I got my picture all over the walls. Right. Not just one picture. Right. I mean, yeah. as in most of the rest. You're, you're, the whole, you're the whole thing. Yeah. That's pretty cool, too, right? Well, it is cool. I mean, uh, yeah, they've done a tremendous job of putting this place together. And, and one of the things that we're looking to do is, is franchise this because, as I said before, you know, not only was it on TV uh, with the Memphis wrestling in, in Memphis, I was on all over every, every Saturday morning, live shows all over the entire state of Tennessee, all over the entire state of Kentucky, eastern Arkansas, southern Illinois, northern Mississippi, and northern Alabama. So, you know, uh, Jerry Lawler's Memphis Bar I, I need all of these states to taste Jerry Lawler's Memphis barbecue. We smoke those for 12 hours and then we'll pull them out and we'll wrap them up here and we'll pull them to the line and we'll sell them. Yeah, you know, right there. about it, one of the top 100 moments in the history of yeah. television. My appearance with Andy Kaufman on the David Letterman Show in his first year, 
Of course, it became the, uh, I became the first talk show guest to strike another guest when I slapped Andy out of his chair. Oh, wow. uh, and and uh, David Letterman admitted, he said, that made our show famous. So we, we uh, that, that was 35 years ago, and people still talk about it today. Wow. All right, what do you want to try first? Uh, let's, go ahead, go ahead. With let, let's let's do the barbecue pork rinds. Y'all do these in-house. I'm gonna get. Yes, we do. I'm gonna get. To, look at this. And they 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 even complemented with a little bit of jalapenos and nacho cheese. Let's let's try this out. Let's try it out by first. Mm -hmm. By itself first. You don't waste any time. One bite. I can't do this in one bite. Okay. They're on to something here. <laughs> I never thought about eating pork rinds with actually nacho cheese, and that's a that's a good combo. Right? Yes, it is. Look at this. Oh my gosh, the waffle fabric sweet potato fries. Yep, go that's ahead. Grab one, dip, just dip it in light, lightly in there. Wow. You want to get this dip? Oh my gosh, look at this. That looks okay. Let's try this out. All right. <laughs> Thoroughly, thoroughly impressed. It almost, it's sort of reminiscent of back in the day being at like the Mid-South Fair or the Delta Fair. Yes. And getting one of those big funnel cakes. Funnel cakes mm. all day. Oh, we both got a big red splash. Yeah, splash. Ooh, ooh. So, uh, what do we got here? We have the Big Red Splash. This is called Big Red Splash. Big Red was, uh, big red was a wrestler for us back in the... Um, I guess late 70s, early 80s. Uh, I mean, it, a big African American wrestler that was the most fun to be around, and he he was he he had freckles. I mean, he just had the freckles and and sort of reddish hair, and that's what they call it, big red. And he was famous for. I mean, he was a big guy. He weighed close to 400 pounds. Wow. And he was famous for. He'd get his opponent down and do what he called the big red splash. He'd hit the ropes, come in, dive on them, and just flatten them out right on the mat there. I think that the, uh, the smoked sausage sandwich is my favorite on that. Not by much, but they're all great. But this is really good. Now I'm dying to try to just come on with it. Oh. You can definitely tell that's been cooked for a while. Mm. Now the real test. Everything else is just pre-examination. Come on with the ribs. Ribs. This restaurant is called like fast casual. Mm -hmm. When you come in and you place your order, our goal is to have you eating within four minutes. And it's piping hot when it comes out. This is fantastic. This is good. It's nice to come in and eat with the gang, isn't it? Well, everybody, I'm in here a lot. So, you know, you This is actually an honor. But, uh, you know, come on in. Uh, you never know. I may be having lunch or dinner here. Right. Any, any given day. Right. Please come check out the Kings. The Kings, Jerry Lawler, Memphis Barbecue Company, out here in Cordell. Please come check us out. We're right out in front of, uh, we're right out in front of Target. Super Target. And, uh, yeah, Super, Super Target. Target. Walmart, right near Trinity. Exactly. Next door to Rafferty's, exactly. next door to Moe's, and uh, we're just hanging out here. So come see us. Yeah, come see us. Right. Come check us out. It's all, right. all good. So, that's it. That's all we got for today, guys. Catch you later. All right.